to that all day. That was Sierra Renee and Joshua Henry, stars of Waitress. And if you haven't seen the Broadway hit yet, the clock is ticking. The Tony nominated show is in its final weeks, and it's one you don't want to miss. Here with more are Sierra and Joshua. Hi, guys. Good to see you. Hey, Hi, thanks nice for having us. That's so beautiful. I really could. I mean, just sit there. Talk about <laughs> relaxing, too, and be serenaded by the two of you, which you can see both of you in the show. You both joined in November. What made you want to sign on knowing that it was kind of winding down? I mean, to be honest, my friend Sierra, she, I heard that she was going to be Jenna, and um, it winding down, I haven't been on Broadway in like three years. Yeah. So knowing that this was just going to be six weeks, the combination nice, of that, right? and working yeah. with a friend who I respect yeah. so much, was like, was my reason enough. It's a no-brainer. Yeah. 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 You know, it's, it's been one of the most popular and successful shows on Broadway. What do you think it is that, that people love about this show so much? I mean, I think it has so much heart. Yeah. You know, and it's there's a lot of reality in it, and then there's also this unreality, ethereal, fun, comedic, you know, texture to it as well. Um, but yeah, I just think that it really it speaks to um, you know just a lot of deep feelings, human experiences. Yeah. Well, and you know, it's it's been applauded for its casting choices. It's made a lot of headlines for it. How do you think this show has put its stamp on Broadway? I think for me, well, last night. I, I just got a, a couple messages from uh, um, some young actresses and actors who were like, seeing you perform this role makes me feel like so many more doors are open for me. Yeah. So that, for me, I, I'm, that's, for me, that's the top for me. Yeah. So I'm grateful that they can see themselves on stage and yeah. then mm -hmm. I, we can be a part of opening yeah. up doors in that way. For mm -hmm. me, that's, that's everything. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, and you guys, like you mentioned before, you've worked together before in The Wrong Man. Yeah. I don't know if you've worked mm -hmm. together in other things, too, but <laughs> yeah. what's it like being back together and being, um, uh, being on stage on Broadway, getting to experience this together, together it, again? It, it's so lovely. Like, uh, he surprised me and told me before <laughs> it had been announced that he was going to be my palmiter. He called me. I thought he was pranking me. He's like, congrats on Jenna. I'm going to be your palmiter. I was like, what? Because <laughs> <laughs> it was... You're like, I mean, oh, wouldn't that be nice? I know. It's a dream come true. I mean, when we worked together on Wrong Man, it was um, such a like healing and compassionate and beautiful um, project that we got to work on together, and we became really good friends. And I respect you so much, so mm. it was great to know that he, you know, we were going to be on this one together. Especially yeah. like you said, coming back after not doing Broadway for so long, and you know, stepping back into this and being like, okay, yeah. I'm surrounded by people I know and trust and love. Yeah, you know? support really system. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, now that you know the show backwards and forwards, <laughs> what are your favorite parts you have to have a favorite moment Ooh, in the show right absolutely I mean oh my god there's so there's many so, though there's so many <laughs> I, I, for me it's got to be you matter to me mm, because yeah. that message that you know of I see you mm -hmm. no matter who you are no matter what you you don't have to climb a mountain to for me to see you you can just be yourself yeah and, and you matter and you matter yeah it's something that I would love to give like my kids and everyone seeing the show I think that's a really important yeah. message yeah 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 I love that I also <laughs> Funnily enough, one of my favorite um, songs is um, the old Joe song. Take it from an old man. Take it from yes, an old man. I love that one it's too. So, it's just so sweet. Yeah, you know? I've seen the show uh, two or three times. Yeah, yeah it's mm -hmm. such a good show. <laughs> so for anyone who hasn't seen it, definitely come back, go and see it. But yeah. just quick Bridgerton, the Bridgerton the musical. I know hey. people both teamed up on a song from that <laughs> and you covered one. Oh, if the nice. show came to Broadway, is this something you'd want to do together? We've talked about this many really? times. Really? A million times. So, so we want yes. this. Now this now must happen. Yes, we definitely <laughs> Definitely want to do happen. this. For sure. <laughs> We're putting it out there. Come everybody. on, manifesting. But we have done that with this show before, so I'm, I'm gonna. Next time you come on, we're gonna be talking about the Bridgeton musical. Okay, you can catch Love Waitress it. on Broadway <laughs> now through January 9th. For tickets and more info, head to waitressthemusical.com. Thank you so much, guys. Thank Great you. To talk to you. <laughs>